1. A client taking warfarin, coumadin, is prescribed aspirin for pain relief. What is the nurse's best action? A. Administer both medications as ordered. B. Notify the healthcare provider immediately. C. Give aspirin with food to reduce irritation. D. Monitor blood glucose levels. Answer, B. Rationale, both drugs increase bleeding risk. Strategy, avoid combining anticoagulants with NSAIDs or antiplatelets. 2. A client receiving digoxin and furosemide is at risk for which complication? A. Hypertension. B. Hyperkalemia. C. Digoxin toxicity. D. Hypoglycemia. Answer, C. Rationale, furosemide causes hypokalemia, increasing digoxin toxicity risk. Strategy, monitor potassium and digoxin levels closely. 3. A patient taking ACE inhibitors and spironolactone is most at risk for A. Hypokalemia B. Hyperkalemia C. Hyponatremia D. Hypocalcemia Answer, B. Rationale, both retain potassium risk of hyperkalemia. Strategy, avoid high potassium foods, monitor serum K. 4. A patient prescribed nitroglycerin and sildenafil, Viagra, should be warned about. A. Severe hypotension. B. Tachycardia. C. Hyperglycemia. D. Seizures. Answer, A. Rationale, both cause vasodilation life-threatening hypotension. Strategy, never combine nitrates with erectile dysfunction drugs. 5. Combining MAO inhibitors and SSRIs can lead to A. Neuroleptic malignant syndrome B. Serotonin syndrome C. Malignant hyperthermia D. Stevens-Johnson syndrome Answer, B. Rationale, excess serotonin leads to agitation, hyperreflexia, and fever. Strategy, allow two-week washout between MAOI and SSRI. 6. A client taking warfarin is prescribed trimethoprim sulfamethoxazole, Bactrim. What should the nurse monitor? A. INR. B. Creatinine. C. Blood glucose. D. Heart rate. Answer, A. Rationale, sulfa drugs increase warfarin effect bleeding. Strategy, monitor INR closely or avoid combination. 7. A patient taking lithium and furosemide is at risk for A. Hypotension. B. Lithium toxicity. C. Hypertension. D. Hypoglycemia. Answer, B. Rationale, diuretics reduce sodium lithium retention. Strategy, maintain consistent sodium intake. 8. Which drug combination can cause severe muscle breakdown, rhabdomyolysis? A. Statins plus erythromycin. B. Statins plus beta blockers. C. ACE inhibitors plus diuretics. D. Calcium channel blockers plus digoxin. Answer, A. Rationale, erythromycin inhibits statin metabolism toxicity. Strategy, avoid macrolides with statins. 9. Warfarin combined with amiodarone causes. A. Decreased anticoagulant effect. B. Increased bleeding risk. C. Increased clot formation. D. Bradycardia. Answer, B. Rationale, amiodarone potentiates warfarin's effects. Strategy, INR monitoring is essential. 10. Metformin and 4-contrast dye should never be given together because A. Hypoglycemia risk B. Lactic acidosis C. Liver toxicity D. Hypernatremia Answer, B. Rationale, for contrast impairs kidney clearance metformin buildup. Strategy, hold metformin 48 hours before and after contrast. 11. Theophylline combined with ciprofloxacin may cause A. Toxic CNS stimulation B. Hypotension C. Bradycardia D. Constipation Answer, A. Rationale, ciprofloxacin increases theophylline levels. Strategy, avoid concurrent use or monitor drug levels. 12. Combining benzodiazepines and opioids can result in A. Hypertension B. Respiratory depression. C. Bradycardia. D. Hyperactivity. Answer, B. Rationale, both depress CNS fatal respiratory suppression. Strategy, avoid concurrent use unless absolutely necessary. 13. A patient on linozolid, MAOI-like antibiotic, taking sertraline, SSRI, is at risk for A. Serotonin syndrome. 
B. Hypotension C. Seizures D. Hypoglycemia Answer, A. Rationale, linozolid increases serotonin levels. Strategy, avoid concurrent serotonergic drugs. 14. Calcium supplements reduce the absorption of A. Iron B. Levothyroxin C. Digoxin D. Warfarin Answer, B. Rationale, calcium binds levothyroxin in GI tract. Strategy, take thyroid meds alone on empty stomach. 15. Antacids should not be taken with ciprofloxacin because A. It increases bleeding risk. B. It decreases antibiotic absorption. C. It increases drug toxicity. D. It causes diarrhea. Answer, B. Rationale, antacids bind quinolones decreased absorption. Strategy, take two hours apart. 16. Potassium supplements with ACE inhibitors can cause a. Hypokalemia B. Hyperkalemia C. Hypoglycemia D. Hypertension Answer, B. Rationale, both increase serum K. Strategy, avoid potassium-rich foods and supplements. 17. A client taking methotrexate and NSAIDs is at risk for A. Renal toxicity B. Hypoglycemia C. Anemia D. Seizures. Answer, A. Rationale, NSAIDs reduce methotrexate clearance. Strategy, avoid combining unless closely monitored. 18. Beta blockers and calcium channel blockers together can cause A. Tachycardia. B. Severe bradycardia. C. Hypertension. D. Hyperglycemia. Answer, B. Rationale, both depress cardiac conduction. Strategy, monitor HR and BP carefully. 19. Combining MAOIs with tyramine-rich foods, cheese, wine, can cause A. Hypotension B. Hypertensive crisis C. Seizures D. Bradycardia Answer, B. Rationale, tyramine causes excessive norepinephrine release. Strategy, strict diet restriction with MAOIs. 20. Allopurinol with azathioprine can cause a. Bone marrow suppression. B. Hyperuricemia. C. Seizures. D. Hypotension. Answer, A. Rationale, allopurinol inhibits azathioprine metabolism. Strategy, avoid or adjust dosage. 21. A nurse should not administer clopidogrel with omeprazole because A. It increases bleeding. B. It reduces clopidogrel's effect. C. It causes hypotension. D. It increases platelet count. Answer, B. Rationale, omeprazole inhibits activation of clopidogrel. Strategy, use pantoprazole if PPI is needed. 22. Phenytoin and oral contraceptives combination causes A. Increased pregnancy risk. B. Hypocalcemia. C. Hypertension. D. Hyperglycemia. Answer, A. Rationale, phenytoin induces enzymes that metabolize estrogen. Strategy, use backup contraception. 23. SSRIs and St. John's wort may cause A. Serotonin syndrome B. Hypotension C. Fatigue D. Constipation Answer, A. Rationale, both increase serotonin activity. Strategy, avoid herbal antidepressants with SSRIs. 24. Cimetidine, Tagamet, with warfarin can result in A. Increased bleeding B. Decreased INR C. Hypotension D. Hypokalemia. Answer, A. Rationale, cimetidine inhibits warfarin metabolism. Strategy, use famotidine instead. 25. Loop diuretics with aminoglycosides can cause A. Hearing loss. B. Hyperglycemia. C. Liver failure. D. Hypotension. Answer, A. Rationale, both are ototoxic. Strategy, monitor hearing and renal function. 26. Metronidazole with alcohol causes A. Antabuse reaction, flushing, vomiting B. Bradycardia C. Hypoglycemia D. Diarrhea Answer, A. Rationale, disulfiram-like reaction occurs. Strategy, avoid alcohol during and 48 hours after treatment. 
27. Warfarin and garlic supplements increase. A. INR. B. Platelet count. C. Glucose level. D. Blood pressure. Answer, A. Rationale, garlic has natural anticoagulant properties. Strategy, avoid herbal supplements that increase bleeding. 28. SSRIs with tramadol increase the risk for A. Serotonin syndrome. B. Hypoglycemia. C. Seizures. D. Hypertension. Answer, A. Rationale, both increase serotonin activity. Strategy, avoid concurrent use. 29. Levothyroxine with iron supplements can cause A. Decreased thyroid absorption. B. Hyperthyroidism. C. Increased BP. D. Tremors. Answer, A. Rationale, iron binds levothyroxine. Strategy, take 4 hours apart. 30. Insulin and beta blockers can mask signs of A. Hypoglycemia. B. Hypertension. C. Hyperkalemia. D. Fatigue. Answer, A. Rationale, beta blockers block sympathetic symptoms. Strategy, monitor glucose closely. 31. Cough medicines with MAOIs may cause A. Hypertensive crisis. B. Hypotension. C. Bradycardia. D. Hypoglycemia. Answer, A. Rationale, dextromethorphan interacts with MAOIs. Strategy, avoid OTC meds containing sympathomimetics. 32. Heparin and aspirin combination causes A. Severe bleeding. B. Increased platelet count. C. Hypotension. D. Constipation. Answer, A. Rationale, both are anticoagulants. Strategy, avoid unless prescribed and closely monitored. 33. Calcium channel blockers with grapefruit juice can lead to A. Hypotension B. Tachycardia C. Hyperglycemia D. Seizures Answer, A. Rationale, grapefruit inhibits drug metabolism toxicity. Strategy, avoid grapefruit with CCBs. 34. Amoxicillin clavulinate with allopurinol can cause A. Rash B. Hypertension. C. Hyperglycemia. D. Liver failure. Answer, A. Rationale, allopurinol increases risk of skin reactions. Strategy, report rash immediately. 35. ACE inhibitors with NSAIDs can cause A. Kidney damage. B. Liver toxicity. C. Hyperglycemia. D. Hypotension. Answer, A. Rationale, NSAIDs reduce renal blood flow. Strategy, avoid chronic NSAID use. 36. Carbamazepine with erythromycin can cause A. Toxicity. B. Hypotension. C. Bradycardia. D. Constipation. Answer, A. Rationale, erythromycin inhibits carbamazepine metabolism. Strategy, monitor levels and avoid combination. 37. Valproic acid with lamotrigine increases. A. Stevens-Johnson syndrome risk. B. Hypotension. C. Hyperglycemia. D. Seizures. Answer, A. Rationale, combined use increases rash risk. Strategy, report rash immediately. 38. Cough syrup containing pseudoephedrine with antihypertensives causes A. Elevated blood pressure B. Bradycardia C. Hypoglycemia D. Drowsiness Answer, A. Rationale, pseudoephedrine increases BP. Strategy, avoid OTC cold meds with hypertension. 39. Methadone with benzodiazepines increases A. Respiratory depression B. Hypertension. C. Seizures. D. Tachycardia. Answer, A. Rationale, both are CNS depressants. Strategy, avoid combining sedatives. 40. SSRIs and NSAIDs together cause A. GI bleeding. B. Hypoglycemia. 
C. Hypertension. D. Tremors. Answer, A. Rationale, SSRIs impair platelet function, NSAIDs irritate GI tract. Strategy, use acetaminophen for pain instead. 41. Warfarin with cranberry juice causes. A. Bleeding. B. Hyperglycemia. C. Seizures. D. Rash. Answer, A. Rationale, cranberry enhances warfarin effect. Strategy, limit cranberry intake. 42. Oral contraceptives with rifampin cause. A. Pregnancy. B. Hypotension. C. Hypoglycemia. D. Rash. Answer, A. Rationale, rifampin induces metabolism of hormones. Strategy, use backup birth control. 43. NSAIDs and corticosteroids together increase. A. GI bleeding risk. B. Infection risk. C. Hypertension. D. Hypoglycemia. Answer, A. Rationale, both cause GI irritation. Strategy, use GI protectants if combined. 44. Amiodarone and simvastatin together increase. A. Muscle toxicity. B. Hypotension. C. Hyperglycemia. D. Constipation. Answer, A. Rationale, amiodarone increases statin levels. Strategy, use lower statin doses. 45. Loop diuretics with digoxin can cause. A. Digoxin toxicity. B. Hypertension. C. Hypoglycemia. D. Hyperkalemia. Answer, A. Rationale, loop diuretics lower K-digoxin toxicity. Strategy, monitor K and ECG. 46. SSRIs with MAOIs cause. A. Serotonin syndrome. B. Hypoglycemia. C. Seizures. D. Hypotension. Answer, A. Rationale, excess serotonin accumulation. Strategy, two-week washout required. 47. Tetracyclines with milk cause. A. Decreased absorption. B. Hypertension. C. Rash. D. Constipation. Answer, A. Rationale, calcium binds tetracyclines. Strategy, avoid dairy two hours before slash after dose. 48. Iron supplements with antacids cause. A. Poor iron absorption. B. Hyperkalemia. C. Rash. D. Constipation. Answer, A. Rationale, antacids neutralize acid needed for iron absorption. Strategy, take iron separately. 49. Opioids and antihistamines together cause. A. Sedation and respiratory depression. B. Hypertension. C. Tachycardia. D. Tremors. Answer, A. Rationale, both depress CNS. Strategy, avoid operating machinery. 50. Alcohol with acetaminophen, Tylenol, can lead to. A. Liver failure. B. Hypoglycemia. C. Bradycardia. D. Constipation. Answer, A. Rationale, both metabolized in liver hepatotoxicity. Strategy, avoid alcohol when using Tylenol. Nice work, future nurses. You just learned the top drug combos you should never mix. If this helped, like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more quick NCLEX lessons. Stay smart, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video. Only here on NCLEs Medizi 91.